Hello and welcome to this video where we'll be discussing the Ohio-class submarines. These submarines are considered to be one of the most powerful weapons in the U.S. Navy's arsenal. In this video, we'll explore the history of the Ohio-class submarines, their impressive specifications, and the role they play in modern warfare. Here we go! The Ohio-class submarine is a class of nuclear-powered submarines that are currently operated by the United States Navy. It is a highly advanced and sophisticated weapon system that is designed to operate effectively in a variety of environments. The submarine is considered to be a critical component of the United States' strategic defense posture. The Ohio-class submarine was designed and constructed during the Cold War era in the United States. The design phase of the Ohio-class began in the late 1970s as a replacement for the aging fleet of Polaris and Poseidon ballistic missile submarines. The submarines were built by two shipyards, the Electric Boat Division of General Dynamics Corporation and Newport News Shipbuilding. The first Ohio-class submarine, the USS Ohio, was commissioned in 1981, and the last of the class, the USS Louisiana, was commissioned in 1997. A total of about 20 Ohio-class submarines were built with the last of them being retired from active service in 2028. The Ohio-class submarines are among the largest submarines in the world. They have a length of 170 meters and a beam of 13 meters, and they displace approximately 18,750 tons when submerged. The submarine is powered by two nuclear reactors, which provides it with a virtually unlimited supply of power. The reactors can generate a total of 60,000 horsepower. This power is used to drive the submarine's propulsion system which consists of a turbine that drives a single propeller. The exact top speed of the Ohio-class submarine is classified, but it is believed to be in excess of 25 knots while submerged. Despite its large size, the Ohio-class submarine is designed to be highly maneuverable and agile, thanks to its advanced control systems and rudder designs that allow it to turn and change direction quickly. The Ohio-class submarines are crewed by approximately 155 personnel including officers and enlisted sailors. The crew is organized into different departments, each with a specific set of responsibilities. The departments include the commanding officer and executive officer, the operations department, the engineering department, the weapons department, the supply department, and the medical department. The commanding officer and executive officer are responsible for overall ship operations and maintaining mission readiness. They are responsible for making critical decisions that affect the safety and security of the ship and crew. The operations department is responsible for navigation, communications, and intelligence gathering. This department is responsible for detecting and tracking other ships and submarines, as well as gathering intelligence about potential threats. The engineering department is responsible for maintaining the nuclear reactors, propulsion systems, and other critical mechanical systems on the submarine. The crew in this department is highly trained in nuclear power and engineering, and they are responsible for ensuring that the submarine is able to operate safely and efficiently. The weapons department is responsible for the armament systems on the submarine. The supply department is responsible for managing the logistics of the submarine, including food, fuel, and other supplies whereas the medical department is responsible for the health and well-being of the crew. One of the unique features of the Ohio-class submarine is its endurance ability that make it to operate for very long periods without resupply. It is indeed designed to carry out missions that require extended periods of time at sea, such as strategic deterrence patrols surveillance missions, and special operations. These missions can last for 90 days or more, and this submarine is effectively able to operate for the entire duration of the mission. This capability is made possible by the submarine's advanced design, which includes highly efficient nuclear power plants and a large storage capacity for food and other supplies. Long extended periods at the sea is also made possible by the onboard advanced life support systems that can generate oxygen, remove carbon dioxide, and remove contaminants from the air. The submarine also has a sophisticated water filtration system that can produce fresh water from seawater, which allows the crew to maintain adequate hydration levels. The submarine's payload includes both conventional and nuclear weapons, and it is capable of carrying a significant amount of firepower. The submarine's primary weapon system is its complement of Trident 2D5 ballistic missiles. Each Ohio-class submarine is capable of carrying up to 24 of these missiles, 
which are capable of delivering multiple nuclear warheads to targets up to 7,500 miles away. The Trident II missile is one of the most advanced and accurate ballistic missiles in the world, and it is a critical component of the United States nuclear deterrent force. In addition to the ballistic missiles, the Ohio-class submarine is also equipped with a variety of conventional weapons, including torpedoes and cruise missiles. The submarine's torpedo tubes can be used to launch heavyweight torpedoes that are capable of sinking enemy submarines and surface ships. The submarine is also equipped with Tomahawk cruise missiles, which can be used to strike targets on land and at sea with precision. The Ohio-class submarine's payload is complemented by a range of advanced technologies that enhance its ability to deliver these weapons to their targets. The Ohio-class submarine is equipped with some of the most advanced navigation and communication systems in the world, which are critical for its ability to operate effectively in a variety of environments. One of the most important navigation systems on the Ohio-class submarine is the Inertial Navigation System INS, which uses gyroscopes and accelerometers to determine the submarine's position, heading, and speed. The INS is a highly accurate system that allows the submarine to navigate in areas where GPS signals may be unavailable or jammed. The submarine is also equipped with a variety of communication systems that allow it to communicate with other submarines surface ships, and aircrafts. This includes high-frequency radio system, as well as a low-frequency system. To ensure that the submarine's navigation and communication systems remain effective, the submarine is equipped with a variety of backup systems and redundancies. These include multiple in systems, as well as backup communication systems, in case the primary systems are damaged or compromised. The Ohio-class submarine is one of the most advanced and stealthy submarines in the world. The submarine is designed designed to be as quiet as possible, which reduces the noise signature that it emits into the water. This makes it difficult for enemy forces to detect the submarine using sonar or other acoustic detection methods. The submarine is also equipped with a variety of other advanced technologies that enhance its stealth capabilities. These include special coatings that absorb or scatter sonar waves and advanced propeller designs that minimize noise and turbulence in the water. In addition to its stealth technology, the Ohio-class submarine is also equipped with a variety of other advanced technologies that enhance its operational capabilities. These include advanced sensors and imaging systems that allow the crew to detect and track enemy forces, as well as advanced computer systems that enable the crew to process and analyze large amounts of data. Moreover, the submarine is also equipped with a variety of defensive systems, including anti-torpedo systems and advanced countermeasures that can be used to evade enemy weapons. Finally, the U.S. Department of Defense anticipates a continued need for a sea-based strategic nuclear force. The first of the current Ohio-class ballistic missile submarine, SSBN, is expected to be retired by 2029. Therefore, the replacement submarine must be seaworthy and technologically advanced by that time. A replacement may cost over $6 billion per unit, compared to Ohio's $2 billion. In this regard, the U.S. Navy is exploring two options. The first option is a variant of the Virginia-class nuclear-powered attack submarines, and the second option is a dedicated ballistic missile submarine, either with a new hull or based on complete overhaul of the current Ohio class. We have come to the end of this video. We hope the video was helpful. Let us know in the comment section if this video was helpful in as far as updating your knowledge of Ohio-class submarines. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more informative and exciting content like this. Hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications to never miss an update. Thank you for watching.